What's up guys, it's Wally, and today we're going to be doing some battles with a rental team featuring all three forms of Volcarona. Now this team did come to us as a rental from our buddy Lycan, and this team absolutely slaps, despite the fact that all three forms of Volcarona have a 4x weakness to something. And Volcarona does have a 4x weakness to rock, Slitherwing has a 4x weakness to flying, and Iron Moth does have a 4x weakness to ground. Which to me, I think is probably the most dangerous, considering all the Great Tusks and a lot of other Pokemon that do have Earthquake, uh, or Earth Power, or moves of that sort. But that's where the Terrestrialization comes in. And that's where having three other Pokemon on this team that can really kind of cover for all that really comes in handy too. Like especially Iron Bundle, because that thing actually takes care of all three of those things. You can always use the Icy Wind or Freeze Dry into a Ground type, a Flying type, and the Chilling Water can go into a Rock type or a Ground type. So either way, Iron Bundle can really kind of make up for a lot of those weaknesses. But aside from that too, Electros is really nice because it does have Levitate. So if you do see a Ground Mount out there or something that you think might end up using Earthquake or something like that, you can always throw Electros out there to be able to not take any damage from that move, despite the fact that Electric typically is weak to ground. And aside from that too, Screamtail, which is an extremely bulky Pokemon, is out there to be able to lower attack and special attack with Noble Roar, as well as beefing up your own attack with Howl. Also, it does have Dazzling Gleam and Encore if you do want to pull those shenanigans. The three Volcarona, however, I think are really the main piece right here. Now we have Volcarona again, which is just the original one, uh, which is more of kind of like a support one. It does have Rage Powder, it's got Tailwind for nice speed control, uh, but it also has Fiery Dance and Struggle Bug as well. And Struggle Bug is nice because it does lower the special attack of both Pokemon across the way, and as a bug type, it's nice to be able to go into like Armor Rouge or Indeedee or Pokemon like that. I mean, despite the fact that Armor Rouge doesn't take that as super effective damage, it is neutral, but it does lower their special attack by one stage. Slitherwing, on the other hand, is definitely out there for a lot of damage. Now, this thing does have Leech Life and Body Press as two really strong stab moves, as well as Flame Charge if we do end up terrestrializing. It's going to be another good stab move as well, and something that's going to be able to speed us up. In addition, it does also have Bulk Up, so if we do need to up our attack and our defense for some reason, that's always out there as well. And last but not least, we have Iron Moth, which is nice because it is a fire and a poison type, so we don't really have to worry much about fairy type moves. Uh, I did say, however, unfortunately, we will have to worry about the ground type moves, but if we do terrestrialize into grass, we're not really gonna have to worry about that. That turns from a 4x effective move into a resisted move, so that's gonna be extremely nice. And in addition to that, we do have energy ball, which would be a stab move if we end up terrestrializing. And even if we don't terrestrialize, that'll still be really nice to do a lot of water, ground and rock type Pokemon as well. In addition, we have Protect because it's definitely important, especially on this Mon, but as well as Heat Wave, which is a really nice spread move that is a stab and extremely strong and has the chance for a burn as well. And Acid Spray, which is nice because that does kind of work as a little bit of support as well because it does lower the target's special defense by two stages. So if we do have Iron Moth and then we have another special attacker like uh, Iron Bundle or uh, Scream Tail or something like that, then we'll be able to lower their special uh, defense by two stages and do an extra power move over there. So that's our team. We had a lot of great battles with this and I'm excited to show them to you. So we'll get into the battles, but before we do, as always, if you guys are new here, just haven't yet, please make sure to go down and hit the subscribe button. If you guys do enjoy the video, please make sure to drop a like too. Go enjoy the battles, guys. Let's start Bundle Lamp. And then what's, what's Scream Tail have again? And then Encore too, that's true. Bring Scream Tail in the back. I'm gonna bring Slitherwing too. Let's go for it. Yeah, I would imagine that's what they're gonna go with. It... Damn. Guitar Talon. And bundle of Electros. So let's go. Um, what's our terror? We're water terror. Ooh, I like that. Um, that actually wouldn't be a horrible idea. It would stop the the rock. Let 
gonna go chilling water into T Tar. Let's go Thunder Punch up there. If I had more time, I probably would have ended up going for the uh, Drain Punch, though. I did not realize it had Drain Punch on it. Sorry, now we get a lot of that damage back, too. Protect with Bundle here. Let's go Drain Punch into T-Tar. Let's go. Rock Slide again. They will never expect it. You are absolutely right. And again, when was the last time you saw any Electros on the, uh, on the ladder, right? Oh, that doesn't even KO fully. Oh boy. It's okay, though. That's okay. Talonflame getting KO'd there. Or not getting KO'd there is a little rough. Still go chilling water into T Tar because Talonflame gets KO'd. Yep. And Bundle survives. That's true. That's a good point. That's a good point. Slitherwing is actually going to be incredible here now. Well, depending on who the other Mons are. I forget who there was. Or who they had, I should say. Either way, though, man, Electros is doing some, some good work here. Bundle's gone now, unfortunately, but... Okay, I think I'm going to hold off on Slitherwing for right now. Just to see who's out there. Come on now, who are you sending out? Big bundle is big down, unfortunately. Alright. So we would have been fine. Ah, bundle me bundle. Nice to meet you. What up, Wolf? How you doing tonight, dude? Intimidates, lowers their attacking special. Oh, that's actually cool. Did not realize that was the, uh... That was the case. Nah. And let's do that in a bundle. Into electric? Into grass, okay. It used to be Pyro Signature. It's a cool move. I'll give them that for sure. I wonder if they know that I'm not a... I wonder if they know I'm not a water type. Sometimes it won't protect. Um, Uh-oh. Ooh! Let's go, baby!
dope. Oh, and that raises our uh, our special attack too, huh? That's pretty cool. We'll take that. Good damage. No, it's only from uh, spread moves. Spread moves. Shiny, thank you very much for the 200 bits, by the way. I appreciate that a lot. Bye, Electros. Cooking for sure, man. Best part here now, their Tailwind's gone, which really, realistically, doesn't matter too much, but let's do that. They don't have anything that is super effective against us. So I feel good here going with a, um... No. Actually, we are plus one. But do I even care about a Dazzling Gleam right now? Yeah. Let's just go for the Dazzling. We go into a fire, but that would be really, really tough, though. We'd be... Yeah. We'd have a really hard time with that. So let's go with the uh, Leech Life over in Sandy. That's fair. Okay. Uh, max speed. Wait, hold on. You mean... Yeah, it kind of helps us a little bit. I think what we're going to do is we're going to Terrastalize Fairy here just so we can make sure we knock out um, on them. Yeah, and that's okay. I mean, we're totally fine with that. Again, we could have terrestrialized fire, but then we would have we could have gotten hit with a uh, an earth power as well as a uh, hydro pump as well. So we don't want that. Trust me. Dazzling Gleam, and add a plus one as well. Goodbye. That's what I'm talking about. And then the Leech Life... Pardon me. The Leech Life should finish it off. Goodbye, Sandy. It was good seeing ya. You were a good mon. Were. But good game on that. Let's go. Moth team win number one. GG's. Let's go Volcarona and Screamtail. Why not? Then we'll bundle and... Hmm... Let's go Lamp as well. They served us well in the last one. Thanks, Lycan. Alright, let's see this. Oof, okay. Okay, I see you. Oh my, I like that actually. Wow, Screamtail does have a lot of special attack now, doesn't it? Fair enough, my friend. Let's go with the uh, let's go with the struggle bug on this one. And let's go no a little bit of noble roar over into Armor Rouge.
Mm. All right, best part is we can actually encore. Oh, yeah, no, 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 because then they're going to end up putting up a reflect on, huh? Nice crit on Armor Rouge, too. Oh, they're lefties. Alright, guys. Well. Alright, because, hold on. Who else do they have? Yeah. Yeah, we're going to need that. So let's do that. Let's go for the Dazzling Gleam. Even though that's not going to do much to Armor Rouge. That's fine. If they swap into uh, Roaring Moon here, it's all right. Still super effective. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. You're going to Encore me. Well, I mean, that's fine. Oh, into you, though. Hate to do it, but especially since that kind of wastes our um, our throat spray. But it's okay. Ooh, that encore ain't gonna do anything, my friend. Well, that's not good. So we're gonna go chilling water. Well, I kinda wanna keep you as a fairy terra though. Substitute Chi you flutter super underrated. I can understand that. Okay, at least we'll get some damage over there, too. Okay, so now they're a plus one. Good damage. Awesome. Okay, good. They did not know about Levitate. That is awesome. Going for it, I'm totally... Oh! I shouldn't have clicked through so fast. That's fine. I wanted to keep going with that anyways. Even though you're probably going to do a disable now. <sighs> I meant to do that over disable. I... back up to that. Failwind's gone. Their light screen's gone. Let's do that and let's go for the drain punch. If I thought that they were going to go for another one, and the crit too, got the berry though, and we're going to get a drain punch as well.
Ay. The damage. A fiery dance into Sableye. We're gonna do that to Sableye too. That's fair. That's fair. It's fair. Rocky helmet. That's awesome. Kind of wish we would have done a uh, drain punch over there now, though. Okay, let's go Scream Tail here. I mean, yeah, it's a little tough. By the way, let's terrestrialize. Let's go for the Dazzling Gleam. We go Liquidation and Sableye just to make sure we don't get hit by a, um, or don't get disabled. I'm sorry, thanks for the Hydrate. Dude, how you doing today? Yeah, I hope this is the right, right thing to go with right here. So you had a good weekend then? Yep, there we go. That's why we went for the Thunder Punch this time. Oh wait, I mean for the, or for the liquidation, pardon me. Right? Dude, Scriptail is really cute. Nice, and I hope the liquidation actually knocks out uh, Sableye, too. And good to see that some people are actually putting the berries on that... Uh... No, it doesn't. Um... Shoot. Yeah, there's Roaring Moon. Oh, this is tough now. This is tough. I think that's going to be more important, to be honest with you. Yeah, that's disabled, and so let's go for the liquidation in the Sableye. That's going to make it so that we can actually go for a Dazzling Gleam on the next one, and be able to make that be the end. It's fine. That's perfect. So we're good, don't worry. We're good, I think. Screamtail, they're gonna obviously, you're right, go into um, go into a flying type. But could be worse. So let's go for the Icy Wind and let's go for the Dazzling Gleam. Screamtail is, ex yeah, it does seem like it's extremely bulky. And with the base stats that it has, yeah. Even if you didn't put any bulk into it in terms of EVs, that thing's still gonna take a, a good amount of good amount of uh, attacks. Here comes the flying Terra. 
should I watch this be a Steel Terra? Oh, thank God. Okay. <laughs> Scared me for a second there. That would have been bad now. Can't encore anyone. Let's go. Slow him down. Yeah, that would have been a really bad time. A really, really bad time if that was a Steel Terra. Yikes. At least the um, Dazzling Gleams are going to be single, single target. Yikes. Okay. The good thing here, <laughs> at least we can go freeze dry, and at least we can go for Dazzling Gleam. Oh boy. That was a close one. And the light screen's gone now too, so we're good. Yeah, he definitely should have went for, uh... Should have went for Bundle on that one. But let's go, still. We take that. Good game. Let's go Moth and, uh... Let's go Moth and Lamp. With Bundle and... Damn. Yes, sir, Electros. Uh, I am not 100% sure yet, Gimlet. I'm still still considering it and thinking about travel and, and all that kind of stuff. So, potentially, but I am not 100% sure yet. Dude, what about you, though? Yeah. Let's go, that ups our speed. Nice. And yep, fire poison. We're good on that, so let's go with the heat wave. Ah, oh, well that's not great. But let's do that, and let's try to do that up in the Star Raptor. That works. Yeah, they might be. That's so much damage. Star Raptor gets burnt, too. That's huge. That's also huge. That's not. I've got a berry, though. And I have Papa Berry, too. Hmm. Let's protect over there. Do that. The two life trusses. Battle stance changed. Let's go. Nice. Good turn right there. Big time commitment. Oh yeah, Gimlet. I totally get that then. I totally understand that. Dude, hopefully that'll be one that's uh that's close to you that like could be like a fun like little uh, little family trip too you know but of course I mean at that age though I know that's extremely tough and we're cooking as much as we possibly can or trying to uh, do I play any other game oh absolutely I love to play other games as well it's just you know needless to say this one's a this one's a fun one um uh, we can kind of sack them here, though. So let's go with the Heat Wave. And let's go Liquidation. That's fair. 
Oh, does it really? Let's see. Oh, that takes bundle down. Let's go. On the crit too. Hazel, what's going on? How you doing? Long time no see. I'll be Ben. But what else do I play? So I love playing like um, like the Zelda games. Those are a lot of fun. I love any Mario game too. Those are those are awesome as well. Um, I do love playing like Halo, Call of Duty, um, and playing Fortnite, Fall Guys, and stuff like that too. Drip, what's up, my dude? How you doing, man? Hold on one second. Let me get you a uh, let me get you a, a shout out right here. Let's do that. All right, that's cheating, Marsha. I'm kidding, though. I'm kidding. I appreciate that. Drip, thank you very much for the raid. And Hero of Time, thank you for the follow. I appreciate it. Drip, speaking of Fortnite, here we go. Drip, how was, uh, how was stream? How was Fortnite tonight? No one you could... Oh, I got you. Drip, how you doing, though, man? Uh, which show do you... So, Alien, I love all the, uh, the Black Ops ones. Um... But, um, but Modern Warfare 2 has actually been a, a lot of fun. Alien, thank you very much for the gifted sub, dude. I appreciate that. Come on, you're too kind. Too, too kind. <clears throat> and Shiny, thank you very much for the 100 bits, too. I appreciate that as well. Oh, yeah, but guys, I don't think I said it yet, but if I haven't... Regardless, you guys, if you guys aren't following Drip yet, you guys make sure to go hit the link. Go check him out. Awesome, awesome dude. And... Sorry. Um, but yeah, definitely something you guys should go check out. Let's go. Good game on that one.